Hi there, everybody. It's your friend Kevin uh, Skull Anderson here, back with another video. What? You didn't think I was going to pull off a of WrestleMania? Because I'm inspired by his videos. I watch his videos all the time, so that's how I know. Anyway, you're looking at another art prize drawn from myself to one of my contestants who was one of the winners of my original character open a few months ago back in the spring. Her name is Little Invisible One with two zeros beside the one on the left obviously because reasons. Right, so let's get started. Let's get started on this shit, huh? Yeah, let's get started! Yeah! Yeah, man. Yeah. 
You guys starting to see the big picture now? Because I know that you are. But many of you are probably too busy listening to CNN or MSNBC. And that's understandable, considering they have a history of brainwashing people. So, it all comes together somehow. By the way, it is worth noting, this took me about three hours to do, and despite the fact that I drew three of my friend Little Invisible 001's characters in the same exact pose that they were in before, when she initially drew them, I figured I might try my hand at drawing them digitally because reasons, right? Because obvious reasons. Now, don't know if you guys are aware of this or not, but I've been using for a few years now this unusual technique of mine that I call Tracer No Tracer. Essentially what I do is I pull up a picture of a character that I want to draw in another window and in a separate window I draw that character on DeviantArt Muro while looking at the character from the other window in a separate window you know so basically what I do is I draw a character based on what I see in that character from the window beside the window in which I'm drawing it. And that's Tracer No Tracer in a nutshell, right? It's pretty much it. I know it sounds confusing as hell, but still, it all makes sense once you look at it from my point of view. So, it all figures itself out. Yeah.
By the way, it is worth noting, I take my time doing what I do, and at the very least, I do it pretty seriously. I take it very seriously what I do, so at the end of it, it all comes together, now doesn't it? Of course it does. By the way, I had to refresh this. Because for whatever reason, it just seemingly fucked up on me. No explanation given. I had to refresh it a bit. So, yeah. It all comes together somehow, doesn't it? By the way, this is later on. Right? This is later on. You know, having having done all this, right?
Never really supposed to have been a secret, now was it? I mean, you tell me. Because this is where things really, really started to get interesting. It's right around here when I did the background and stuff. Right? And there we go. That's the ficking picture in a nutshell, right? Anyhow, I spent like three hours on this. And I did the shading for some of the characters' clothing for good reason. And I at least had a decent background this time. So, that's pretty much it. See you in another video, right? Take care.